nice popular box and quirky box time. First of all, we've got Josh's sub. Hi there. There we go. Let's see what we got. It went to the sorting office because when we were away, I had a red. Well, I didn't have a red sub. I had something that was delivered that didn't turn up. Went and we ended up with three boxes. So all popping a box apart from one. Doing a terrible. I'm doing a terrible job of this. It's not, that, it's not that hard. See what we got, eh? Oh, I can already see. Uh, it's two uh, Battlestar Galactica pops. I bet you guys didn't pay for them now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was going to store all of these, but I've already got now, uh, you can see, Captain Apollo. And the second one I've got. Oh, is it that way? Oh, no. Commander Adama. And it comes from the set, so you can get Apollo, Adama, who else? Uh, Starbuck and a Cylon Centurion. There you go. So, two of the four sets. Right then. Next, single box. I think this is actually Handsome Jack. Now it's doing a terrible job. Yeah. <laughs> yep, it's Handsome Jack That's from Borderlands. Fun. So, there we go. It's Handsome Jack from Borderlands. And then, as you can see from the collection, you get Handsome Jack, Moxie, Claptrap, and Psychopath. Is it Psychopath? Or it's just Psycho. Well, then you've also got your two versions that you can get of Claptrap, which is Gentleman Claptrap and Blue Claptrap. I believe they are both GameStop exclusives. And then you've also got the red version of Moxie, which I can't remember where her exclusive is. But yeah, there we go. Handsome Jack. Oh. Let's get the doggies occupied. We'll do, we'll do Quirky Box last if you want. Yep. It's actually his birthday present, but it's not his birthday for like two weeks. But I'm nice. I'm going to let him have it. Early. And here's everyone's favourite little mascot of mine, Lyobrin Martel. I'm sticking his claws down my back, I hope you know. <laughs> Here we go. Let's see what we got. Okay. Oh, it's just the one. So, what was sort of into, what's been delivered today will be our, ours. Yeah. But yeah, I've been waiting for him since I actually joined for Pop in a Box, and I was like, I will hold off. I will wait. I can wait. And the wait has prevailed because here we have Deathwing, and he's obviously from the Warcraft set, which. As you all know from my past videos, I pretty much have most of these now. I obviously do not have a Murloc. I have Illidan and Arthas. I don't think I've got Thrall and I don't think I've got Sylvanas. Sorry, I was pointing out and you couldn't see. And obviously Shadow Illidan, I don't have either. Yeah. But do we really want to pay £150 for that pop when we just bought Headless Ned? No, that's very true. It's very, very true. Yes. Yep. Um, but yeah, at least you've finally got one. Yep. This is my other oversized, and if you do sub to pop in a box next month, one in four pops is actually going to be an oversized, it's oversized month. Eddie hasn't actually officially said this, but he said it on my um, unboxing post. So, if like me, and I believe, um, I think it was Trish as well, she was actually saying she's all going to up um, Where Beth and All Part 2 pop subs to four, so we're definitely going to get an oversized. So you get want to get an oversized, up it to four. You want you want to get two, up it to eight. Oh. Guaranteed to get those. Guaranteed. It? I mean, you could end up with one pop sub and still get one, or you could end up with a six pop sub and get six oversized. But I'd definitely get thumbing up those oversized pops that you definitely want, because now he's got Deathwing in stock. <laughs> you might even get Deathwing. I know he was quite. And obviously, I got the Goliath in my sub, which you can see behind me. Well, actually, he's behind me. Yeah, just behind me there. And um, yeah, he has a couple of gold smugs, so if you're missing any of those, I'd definitely get them thumbed up. I don't have any of those. I've got the, uh, the standard smug. Um, unfortunately, I uh, wasn't able to get hold of any of the others. And I, you I sold Chase back. Smaug. Well, yeah, I sold Chase Smaug out to one of your friends who I'd promised it to. And uh, did I, didn't I bring you one of them back as well? Did no. I bring? Oh, no, no okay. Because I had them all already. No, that's fine. I had all of them. I had the opportunity to buy them, and I should have done, basically. Yeah, well... <laughs> We're going back to Spain October, we'll see what joys we bring back. Indeed. Right, sorry, Oaks. Um, this is go. the Quirky Box Deluxe Game of Thrones box. Right, pardon me. Sorry about that, just had a phone call mid 
Good one, Van. Again, start again. Quirky box. This is the Game of Thrones Deluxe. Yeah, let's see what we're going here. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually quite intrigued. Ooh. Here we go. Haha, <laughs> wow. I was actually going to buy, we were trying to buy that t-shirt as well. Yeah, this is a t-shirt we were looking at purchasing at uh, uh, MCM or Comic Con in London yeah. this year and weren't able to get the size for it. So, this is, I don't know if it's easy to see from there, this is a House Martel, otherwise well, so you can see it a bit better. And as everyone really knows, the, uh... the dog's called Oberyn Martel, so <laughs> I think Dave knew something there. So. I think he was, uh, yeah. It's keeping her. <laughs> yeah, it's been spying on us. <laughs> yeah. Right, you got a pop. Mm. Yeah, another white. Unfortunately, I've already got this particular pop from the uh, the, series, uh, the edition five set. But that having been said, building an army of the undead is always fun. So let's keep it. You're gonna like this. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Excellent. A uh, Baratheon uh, beer map. Well, drinks map. Bells of the Fury, Didn't it definitely like is. He's allergic to beer. Well, yes, very true. And some uh, training cards. Season 3 training cards, packed off. Thank you very much. I'll try open those in a minute. Ooh, very nice. Two keyrings as well. I've got a uh, House Lannister keyring and a House Targaryen keyring as well. Again, it's probably quite hard to see, but I'm doing the best I can. Oh, wow, that's cool. Right. This is very useful and particularly awesome for me because this is all of the major houses on there, apart from uh, House House Aaron, obviously. <laughs> for some reason, House Aaron don't seem to feature in anything that HBO ever do uh, in terms of material, but I think they've just forgotten about them. But yes, excellent. It's also holog slightly holographic, and I'm probably going to use this. My computer. I'll need my computer. Yes. That was awesome. Yeah, so that's quite a good haul there today. You know, um, anything else to uh, to close with? No, that's everything, guys. I think. <laughs> Sorry about the phone call mid thing there, but hey, at least I know how to edit my films. Right then, are you happy with that? Yes, I'm excited. That was a uh, say. That's a brilliant set of, set of things today, when, especially when we we're only expecting to pick up my sub and ending up getting all that. So yeah. Well, if you want to know about Quirky Box, obviously go on Funko Pop Community UK. Dave Mortkai runs it. I believe he's got helpers too, but obviously the face of the business is Dave Mortkai. He's a top bloke. He's really friendly, really nice. If you've got any questions, you just ask him. And as you can see, he's obviously been following what we're up to. Yeah, and he didn't even ask, and he knew. So. Yeah, and thank you again to uh, to pop in a box for more accurate, you know, uh, subscriptions. Yeah, that's the whole beauty of the whole thumb up and thumb down. You don't do that, you end up with something you don't want. Exactly. Yep, so have a nice day guys. Enjoy collecting. Thank Bye. you. Bye.